What's up, everybody? Y'all know who it is. Lost with Jerry. I am back again, guys. Uh, got three more days before I get up out of here. I'll be on the road and heading back to Illinois. But I think I'm going to make a stop in Texas, see my homeboy, if he's um, still there or not. But we're going to check and see, though. I'm going to end up calling him up or either texting him, let him know uh, before I show up anywhere. Because you never know if he's busy or he's gone somewhere doing something different. Uh, you just can't show up invited, you know, or without calling. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, I don't want to get my uh, behind uh, jacked up. So, I want to be safe with that. Uh, that way I can just keep on rolling whatever it takes. But uh, I will be giving him a text or a call sometime today and see if uh, it's okay to stop by. You know what I'm saying? So they're just like stopping by and getting a little rest before I even get back on the road and heading back to Illinois. So uh, I'm going to be checking in on that with him. Uh, just got a text through here. Uh, all right, that's from uh, somebody else. But anyway, like I said, uh, I will be uh, going out through that way still, you know what I'm saying? I will be, uh, I can go right through Texas or either I don't have to, either way, you know, uh, just make it quick and easy. But um, Red Ruby is ready to go, guys, as uh, most of y'all will see. The engine, I end up cleaning the engine, so I want to make sure she everything is good, you know what I'm saying? The air filter is good over there, you know, that's in that cage right there. Got the battery over here is good to go. Oil change is all good. Uh, fluid is all good. Everything is tightened down real good. So, I mean, it's ready to get up on the highway and do its thing, guys. So, I mean, last time it, it will see the highway. As y'all see the new tires on Red Ruby. Uh, everything's aired up real good on the tires. Y'all see? Uh, I washed it off yesterday because it looked messed up dirty nasty i couldn't see out my window so i had to go ahead and clean it back up you know without messing up the windows so as y'all see it you know but a real ruby's gonna have fun on the highway again guys we're gonna get back out there and do our thing get back safely and be good to go with that end i mean everything is great though but i am i'm only i'm not really getting no rest to uh get ready and go guys uh Really, I'm working through the whole week. Uh, so when I get off Saturday night, you know, I got Saturday morning to get up and hit the road, you know. So, um, I mean, Sunday morning, yeah. Sunday morning, I get up and hit the road and be on my way back. So, I'm not really getting no rest at all. I get my rest in between time as I go. So, uh, that way I know I'm going to get there safe, you know. I ain't got to worry about nothing. You know, um, yeah, but, um, you know, it would have been good to have somebody else with me driving, you know, because when I did the driving last time, that was a, a rough thing to do, but uh, it did tie me out, you know, so many miles, it did get to me, you know, but uh, I'll be all right with it. Got, like, water here coming out the ground. I don't know where this water's coming from, but it's leaking pretty bad here so that's that water on the ground I don't know what that job is coming from but it's coming up off the ground I see it running here so I don't know maybe I can get somebody over here to check it out but it's kind of flooded right up in here too so water lining right there but it's not leaking over there so I don't see what's happening over there but uh Yep, so I end up getting the insurance back through the car again through uh, Illinois Vigo in Illinois. I'm not through the uh, general anymore, so I'm not going through them. Uh, they was more expensive to go through. Uh, since I had the insurance, you know, insurance is very high out here, guys. I mean, ridiculous price. So uh, the gas is okay out here, you know, uh, $3.50. 45 cents a gallon so real ruby is just about on full you know i'm gonna tap it off real good before i leave I always bring my gas on real to, to the gas cap you know what i'm saying so that way i can get a 
more long mileage out of, out of the car, you know what I'm saying? If you fill it all the way up to the gas cap, guys, they give you more, you know what I'm saying? More miles to go with. So, you ever get down to that, underneath that little half a tank on gas, you know, you can always pull over and recap it back off, you know? It saves you a little bit more money doing it that way, you know? Or time schedule, hitting the next gas station, all that other stuff like that. So, once I get in Springfield, you know, I ain't got to fill up no more until I get into Illinois, you know what I'm saying? So, got to push my limit on that, but it'd be easy for me to get get the, uh, keep the gas full at all times, you know? Then you don't have to worry about nothing. So, you got a full tank to work with. But when I do get back, I know the car going to have a lot of miles on it, you know? I'm already sitting up at 167, no, 100, yes, yeah, 6. That's 160, I keep on forgetting, 168,000 miles on it. So that's a lot of miles on this car, so. And Red Ruby will be getting traded in as soon as possible, so. I'm not going to deal with it with them type miles on it, because if I want to hit the highway again, I ain't going to be able to hit it with Red Ruby. So you can do it with a rental car, you know what I'm saying, but I prefer to have my own car, you know. But uh, rent a car is no problem by having. I don't mind having a rent, rent a car. But uh, yeah, the guys out here are charging a lot of money to uh, get Red Ruby back to Illinois. I'm like, no, I'll bump that. You know, I'd rather really just go ahead and drive this cheaper. You know, so we're going to do it that route. But it's don't got hot out here, guys. I don't know what the temperature is. It's like 114 today. That thing saying 106 inside the garage, but outside it's 114. And it's very super hot out here, so I don't want to keep on dealing with this heat, guys. I'm ready to get to the rain, you know, get with the coldness, you know what I'm saying? If I can feel chill, you know, and put on a jacket. Can't do that out here, you know, and just sweat, sweat, sweat all day. If y'all see me sweating outside, but it's hot. But uh, like I said, Two days left, I'm going to be on the road going back to Illinois, guys, and, hey, do what I got to do. You know, I got to get straight to work as soon as I get there, so I hope I can get a few days of rest before I get there where I can go to work, you know what I'm saying? But I got to get them a few days of rest, man, before I do anything. So I'm not getting it out here, but it's hard to take off. Because I got overtime. I don't want to mess up the overtime, so I got to let it keep on going, you know. So once I get in Illinois, I have a, enough money to uh, live off of until I get paid off the next job, you know, and keep it going that way. But anyway, guys, like I said, Lost with Jerry, appreciate everybody out there watching the channel. You know, uh, subscribing to Lost with Jerry's channel, guys, I mean, it make me feel so good inside, you know what I'm saying? I feel proud, you know. Uh, I feel... Love by you guys out there, you know, y'all started subscribing to the channel. All the new people that's come subscribing to my channel, I appreciate every last one of y'all, especially my co-workers that's out here and stuff like that, you know. Uh, they they will be missed, you know what I'm saying? They will be missed, but uh, they just like a phone call away. I can pick up the phone and call them up and see how they doing, and they'll put a smile on my face, uh, you know what I'm saying? And uh, we can do it that way, but... Uh, Anyway, guys, I got to go ahead and get off of here. Get back inside the house because it is hot, steamy out here. I want to go somewhere, but then again, I don't because it's too hot. You know, when you got the car, you feel that heat. I don't want to feel all that, you know. I burn the full tank of gas in the driveway because I want to feel that cold air, you know. But I can go in the house and do the same thing, too. But, yeah, if I want some peace and quiet, I come outside and I get in the car and listen to a little music or watch a little movie. I just got done watching a good movie on Peacock. It's called Freaky Friday. You guys need to go check out that movie, man. It's on Peacock. Look it up. I mean, Freaky Friday. It's, it's not Freaky Friday. It's Fright, Fright Night. Sorry about that. It's Fright Night with Kevin Hart in it. Samuel Jackson. I mean, Terrence Howard. A lot of good movie stars in this movie, man. So y'all need to go ahead and check out that movie, man. I mean, it's nice. So it's a series. So it's like three series on it. And I just got done watching the whole darn thing. So it was a good movie to watch. So I can't wait till next week till the next one come out. But yeah, y'all to go ahead and check it out. And let Lost with Jerry know what y'all think about it. But it's a good movie to watch, guys. 
But anyway, Los Ujiri's up out of here, guys, and I'll catch y'all next video. Third to game. Peace. We out.